What up guys, Nico Sports Cards here, coming back at you with another video. Hope everybody's doing great out there. Having a good week, having a good weekend. Whenever you're watching it, keeping it moving. Uh, what did I get into? We got a couple of Little League games we went to. We got some uh, pizza with the kiddos. Just a chill weekend. We're gonna be doing a Nico box today, but I wanna show you guys a couple of cards. I know I've shown these two before, but, and I think everybody can relate to this. You know when like you're flipping through your slabs, just to, just to flip through them. You're going through and you're like, cool, I remember that one, sweet, sweet, sweet. And then you just hit, you just come across a couple that make you do a double take because you haven't looked at them in a while. And these two were that double take today. So I've shown these before. I pulled these on the channel, sent them in the PSA, got them graded, both came back 10. So this is 2020 Legacy. This is my Burrow Gold. Most gold out of Panini's out of 10. This one is out of 25. But that's cool. Sweet. It's probably my, I don't have, I have no Burrow autos. And I don't really have any color. Like that's definitely my best Burrow card. And then I got a 2020 Legacy Hertz. This is bronze, it's at 100. I also do not have any Jalen Hurts autos. And I went to a show and I was hunting for both of these guys. This was probably two months ago and I'm like, I'm getting an auto, it's time. But the prices were still up. So I waited on it. It was a good call, the price had come down and I still think the market's gonna correct. We're, I know no one likes to hear it, but it's gotta be patient with the market. It's got a, still a little bit of froth in it. It'll come back to earth. It's come back a lot, it's almost there. It's like the parachute is out. We're 90% of the way there. We just gotta stick the landing. So stick with it, you guys. We're almost done with the uh, correction and then we can all buy this stuff on the cheap. In the meantime, we're gonna be doing a Nico box. We've got eight packs. Maybe we maybe we flex it to nine if we need to. Let's see how we do. All right, Hertz, you stay there. Burrow, you stay there. All right, we got 2013 certified, two 2015 prisms. I'm gonna need more room. You can just tell I'm gonna need more room. Two prisms, I got two 2013 Topps Magic. Now, I bought a box of this, so there's three autos per box. I probably opened 12 packs. I probably opened a third of the box. I have not hit any autos yet, so I'm really hoping there's an auto in one of these. Two 2022 Prism Hobby, two 2022 Elite, and then one 2013 Certified. So we're gonna do Certified first, and then we're gonna do Elite. Then we'll do Phoenix, we'll do Prism. I'm gonna save the Topps Magic for last because I just feel like we're gonna get an auto. All right, let's do it. All right. Christian Ponder, oh man, remember that guy? He was a first or second round pick. He did play a couple of games. I'll have to go back and remember what happened there because I feel like he made a fantasy football run. Greg Little, we got a, wow, who's this? I don't know this guy, never heard the name. Blitty Ray Wilson. I'm sure someone's gonna tell me he was awesome, but it's out of 100. That's a really nice looking card, but I don't think Blitty made it very far in the NFL, as far as I know. All right, we got David Wilson and Colin Kaepernick. All right, let's get into the elite. Maybe we pull a pen pals. Najee Harris, Justin Herbert. I'm gonna keep my Herberts. Matt Corral, rookie elitist. Is that gonna be numbered? Not numbered, but a good looking card. We're gonna do rookies there and then other there. David Carr, excuse me, Derek Carr, and an Acres. Nothing in that one. All right. Elijah Moore. Joe Burrow, I'm gonna keep the Burrow. Got a Darren Waller. That's a nice looking card. I have his auto on the way. So it was a redemption out of, I think it was Contenders. I don't remember. Um, but it's either on the way or they're gonna be sending me one of those white sparkle packs from Mosaic. But that is out of 99, nice card. David Montgomery, Jonathan Taylor. All right, let's do Phoenix. One of my favorites. By the way, I'm trying to make the videos just a tad bit faster. I know I can go on sometimes. All right, AJ Brown, Darren Waller again. We got a Leo, is it Chenal or Chenal? Not sure, but it's a rookie. 
Rashad White, silver rookie. Let's see, does it say it? Does it say Prism? It's at a 150. It doesn't say Prism, but it's a silver rookie out of 150. It's a good one. And Hot Routes, Tyreek Hill, not numbered. No hits. This is a thick pack, though. Is it going to be a psych out, fake out, or is it going to be an RPA? Let's find out. Psych out, fake out. See? They got us with the filler. Dalvin Cook, Stafford, Andrew Booth Jr., rookie, filler, Garrett Wilson, numbered out of 125, rookie rising. Does he? So what do you think? He goes for 1,400 yards this year? They're going to have 2,000-yard receivers on the team this year. They're going to have 2,000-yard receivers. Um, it could be... It's probably going to be Garrett Wilson. I don't know who the other ones will be. We've got a contours of Trevor Lawrence. What's your guess on who the second 1,000-yard receiver is going to be? That's not a rookie. That's 22. All right, 2015 Prism. Let's get some gold. These are stuck together. T.Y., Earl Campbell, Melvin Gordon, rookie. That used to be a good card. James Winston, that used to be a great card. And what was it? Maybe 10 videos ago, I pulled the auto. One of the nicest looking cards I've ever seen. Sent it in a PSA, came back a nine. Totally ridiculous. Nothing wrong with that card. All right. Okay, we got some green. Green is not numbered. Anquan Bolden. Josh McCown, and the green is Jason Witten. Not numbered, right? We're hitless so far. Mario Alford. All right, come on, Tops Magic. Bring it home one time. So there's, oh, okay, there's an, is that, is that an insert? We'll find out. Peyton Manning. I love the feel of these cards. They've got, they're somewhere between modern and, and vintage. They did a good job with it. Chris Gragg. Uh, usually there's a mini in there. Matt Schaub, remember that dude? He actually had a couple years, I think it was multiple years where he threw over 4,000 yards. Derek Rogers, mini. Marcel Reese, Rex Burkhead, Andy Dalton, no auto. That is odd. There's supposed to be three autos in every box. I'm telling you, I've opened a third of the box. Robert Lester. That's a rookie. John Simon. A lot of rookies. Chance Warmack. Mohamed Sanu. we got a Lamar Miller mini. Jonathan Dwyer. Shane Barine, And Michael Vick. Let me look at that. I was watching Michael Vick highlights. Last night, funny enough, I was watching highlights of him. I'm gonna make open more packs. Um, God, he was so good. He was better. He was a better runner than Lamar Jackson. I'm just. I'm sorry. He just was. Lamar Jackson's phenomenal, but there was something. Vic had a gear. Like he just had a gear that I've never seen a quarterback have. All right, Cordell Patterson, rookie. Alec Ogletree. All right. Ooh, Le'Veon Bell, and it is autoed. All right. Okay, so. For anybody that watched football, when did he become irrelevant? Like three years ago? For about four years there, three or four years, he was by far the best running back in the league. By far. And I wasn't really like crazy into collecting when that was happening. I wasn't looking at his prices, but I gotta imagine everybody was buying his stuff up. This would have been a monster card. I think next to, who else is in 2013? Travis Kelsey? I think next to Kelsey this, Probably is still, might still be one of the better cards you can get. But look at that. Le'Veon Bell, rookie auto from Topps Magic. I knew it was coming. Percy Harvin, Owen Daniel, and then those dudes. Oh, Jordan Nelson, that's not his rookie though. Um, sweet. All right, we got the auto we wanted. We'll save the rest. Maybe I'll do one more pack. What do you say, boys? Should we do, let's do a Phoenix. We're just going to keep going. Let's do a Phoenix pack. See if we can't, see if we can't get some sick. Should have ended it on the Le'Veon, but what, there's no fun in that. All right, we have a super thick card. I think it's just going to be the jersey. I think it's going to be the jersey because it's really thick. All right, Mark Cooper, Zeke. 
we've got Ty Chandler and maybe we go yeah it's oh it's an it's an R oh it's an RPA I don't want to see it. it's a wide receiver it's a wide receiver for the Packers all right 2022 Oh, it's Christian Watson. Whoa. That is awesome. All right, we got to get the we got to get the thick card sleeves out. I don't even know that 130 points going to hold it. This is why you do extra innings. When you're opening packs and you go hitless. Sometimes I say skip it, but I was feeling the vibe there. We open two more packs. We got the Le'Veon Bell. I don't have a case, but Christian Watson. Look at that. One at a 149. Bookend at a 149. This dude's awesome. Wow, that's a big one. That's for, for me, I've been trying, I've been actually looking for his stuff. I always feel like when I there's a player I want to find, instead of just buying the card, I'm like, oh, I'll just hit it in a pack because that's how the world works. Anyway, that's how that was one of the cards I really wanted to get. Or one of the players. Sweet. All right. And we got a silver Cordell Patterson. That's it, dudes. We're going to cut it off there. Shout out to these guys. They're going to make the NFL super fun next year, but we got the Le'Veon Bell 2013 Tops Magic. None of the um, autos are on card here, but that's a cool card. And then let's be honest, this is the hit. Christian Watson, rising rookie. Little football, little football in there. Nice. All right, ladies and gents, that is all I got for you. As always, thank you guys for watching. Please like, please subscribe. Please have a great day. For now, I'm out. Peace.